Hey guys, welcome to Tony's How To's. In this video, I will show you how to repost someone's story on Instagram. So if you found a story that is, that is actually really interesting or you just really relate to it or you just found it really funny, uh, there's actually a way for us to actually share that story. So I'm going to show you this specific user here that I found. And as you can see, when I scroll over her stories, uh, she's actually able to share a story uh, from someone else. So someone posted this story, but she was actually able to uh, share this specific story. As you can see, when we look over the, the names, over those uh, tagged in the uh, story, you can see the user's tag name there. So you could actually only share stories that you're currently tagged in. So if you're tagged in, the option to share those uh, stories will not be available to you. But if you're tagged in, you will see on your screen uh, the name that uh, the, the button that says repost, and you can just click on that, and that story will be reposted to your account. But how do you actually like repost? You really want to repost that specific story into your account. How do you actually do that? So we have a uh, workaround over this. So let's go ahead and do that. So for example, I want to repost this specific story. So if it's a picture, you could just take a screenshot. But if it's a video, you need to screen re record that. So right now, I'm just going to give you an example if it's a picture. So right now, I have this picture here and I want to repost it. So the first thing you want to do is you want to take a screenshot. So just click on the screenshot buttons or shortcuts on your phone. The screenshot button on my phone is actually the reduce volume button and the uh, turn off button on my phone. So when I click on those, that automatically takes a screenshot on my phone. But it differs on a uh, different phone. So you can check with your manufacturer how you actually take uh, those screenshots. But for me, it's the uh, minimize volume and the turn off button on my mobile phone. So once you've done that, you want to go back into your home screen and you want to go to your gallery. So once in your gallery, you want to go to albums and all photos and all photos. What you want to do here is to actually edit the post first. So here we want to edit this. So click on the uh, square that has the pen on it. That's in the lower left of your screen next to the share button. So just click on that and you'll be redirected to the edit button. Uh, section here. So you want to choose crop and make sure that you crop off the black section that has the art uh, heart and the send button there just to this section here and you want to crop off the section that has the lines into it. So once you've done that just click on the check uh, button there at the lower right and that would save your changes and just click on save and that would save your changes. So now we want to go back into our Instagram. So in our Instagram, we want to click on the plus button at the middle part of our screen. And from here, we want to uh, set a story. So in the story, just choose the image that you want to post uh, this one. And here we just want to pinch away from our screen. And as you can see, this actually makes the illusion that we are we, act, we actually reposted that specific story. And here you can just uh, go ahead and post it to your story and make some changes if you want. You can add stickers and a lot of, a lot of other stuff. So uh, another thing that we could actually uh, do here is when we go back, for example, uh, you that user actually posted that specific um, specific post or story into their account here. Like for example, they posted some, uh, that story here in their account. The thing, other thing that you could do is you want to open up the post and from here, you want to click on the send button at the lower left of that specific post. And here, as you can see, when we actually look over here, we'll see the add to story option there. So if a user posted it to the story, but also included the option to post it into their account. So you also, you'll have the option to actually add this to your story without going over those other steps that we just discussed before. So yeah, thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, you can use the link in the description to subscribe. See you in the next video.